two old ghosts. Or Dr. Seuss, meets Edgar Allan Poe. Not last night, but the night before. Two old ghosts came knocking on my door. Knock, knock, knocking. Or an oar. Half asleep. Under the night light. I saw them both. It was an eerie sight. Eerie. Dreary. Scary. Late at night. I pulled up the cover. Over my head. Held my breath. Until I was nearly dead. Nearly. Nearly. Dead in bed. Hope as I might. They wouldn't go away. Shadows out of my window. They were there to stay. Stay. And stay. And stay. Till the lot of day. I would let them in. If I only knew why. They've come back here. Years after they died. They died. Or someone lied. I cried and cried. From my door to my window. They're now on my roof. What do they want from me? I don't want to seem aloof. I'm aloof. Without proof of a goof. You've got to wait. For now I see. Both of them. Seem to be laughing freely. Why would anybody laugh at me? What on earth? To my eyes disappear. They were walking away. They were taking my fear. No fear. No tear. Not here. I can't believe. They're in their truck. I hear the engine. Am I in luck? Am I a lucky or daffy duck? Wondering why. They came here. They had a laugh. I shed a tear. Tears for fears. Not fearful clears. Oh my gosh. What is this? They're heading towards me. They surely won't miss. I'd kiss a miss or surely have to piss. They're in a slide. Coming around. I see their faces. Altercations abound. Abound around those piercing sounds. Out of their window. I see am I to eye. They yell at me. As they start to fly. We only wanted to say goodbye. They only wanted. To tell me goodbye. I wouldn't let them. I don't know why. I guess I was afraid it'd make me cry. I sigh. Bye. Larry Curtis Spurlock. 1995